Yas essentially forks continuously. Yas has gone through multiple forks every time that there's, in a way, uh, a change on the network parameter change. That's a soft fork, and so the idea is give ample time for the network to test those features and to come to consensus. But more importantly, require give ample time for everybody to know that those functions will be enabled months in advance, so that they should be switching. On to the version of the code that actually supports that feature, and so instead of using the term hard fork, which then confuses people, and that's why they ask you about is there going to be a new token? It's a consensus upgrade.、Um, again, simply because hard fork means something very specific to 99% of blockchain users, and it is not the case in EOS. That's kind of one of the you know the great things or features about it. So. September twenty third is a consensus upgrade. Prior to that, the Mandel should be out in its final format, which is not a consensus upgrade. It's simply a new version of the software, which would be, I guess, equivalent to a soft fork. That should be out perhaps in June. So yes, I would I would stop referring to hard fork. That it, it is not a hard fork in the sense that people typically refer to it as.